Uncle Roger reviewed Kay making fire rice two times before. The first time she used raw rice and cremated garlic. The second time she made fire rice with wet rice. Hiya. Now she back a third time. And today I'm going to be making chicken fried rice. Uncle Roger never feel so scared before. This video is sponsored by ExpressVPN. Niece and nephew, today Uncle Roger hear terrible news about people who live in Louisiana. When they visit certain type of website, they need to submit driver license or ID. And many states in US want to do the same also. Hiya. Uncle Roger, don't trust those sites with ID. You know what happened before? Remember that Ashley Madison thing? Don't get caught, otherwise you're gonna be single and alone like me. That's why I use ExpressVPN to change to different country. Then no need to give ID. ExpressVPN also let me watch so many more shows on all my streaming services. Like Gordon Ramsay show Hell's Kitchen. Do you know Uncle Roger actually appeared in season 21, episode 3? Hell's Kitchen, only on Singapore Netflix. So Uncle Roger used ExpressVPN to change location to Singapore Marina Bay server. Refresh, and now it's there. Listen to Uncle Roger. Don't get caught, use ExpressVPN, watch what you want. Use my link, expressvpn.com slash Uncle Roger to get three months free, or click link in description. And now we start video. Today, I'm going to be making chicken fried rice. I'm putting Hiya, first step vegetable. <sighs> Uncle Roger don't like vegetable. Vegetable tastes like sad. If you want to know what's in the veg, there's carrots. We all know what that vegetable is. Peppies. How much what how, how much vegetable you need? Who you making this fire rice for? A fucking goat! Can you give them a mush round? But not with my metal spoon. What? What she say? What, what she say? say? Can you give them a mush round, but not with my metal spoon? Okay, no, not to use metal spoon in non-stick pan? Fui, uh, Uncle Roger actually quite impressed. This already put her above BBC food. Colors are still oh vibrant. Oh no, oh no! She know this? This the first time Uncle Roger impressed by Kay? Maybe it's not gonna be so bad after all? Okay, here, yeah, I've got some onions here. Onion. Okay. Usually Uncle Roger use shallot. But remember, this Kay cooking. We go easy on her. Better word, it will be its own. And... What? Garlic. <laughs> garlic from cha. Very lazy garlic. Hey, uh, garlic correct, but just use fresh garlic. Don't use garlic from cha, it has no flavour. Well, that went all uh, wrong. <clears throat> so, let's stir it round again. Hey, uh, okay. This is the longest stirring ever. Just jump forward. Kay, do you know about editing? Don't need to show us your whole cooking in real time. I'm going to let that cook for a little bit. About, oh, about, probably about 10 minutes. Add some salty. Salt good? And some pepper in. Pepper good? For egg fried rice, usually we use white pepper. Okay. I'm pretty sure Kay just using normal black pepper. But again, this Kay cooking. At least pepper it in the ballpark of the right ingredient. And then it does say to add some chicken. Chicken good for oh, chicken fried rice? Hold on a minute, Kay. That chicken's already cooked. Yeah, I know. I, I, <laughs> I know. I shouldn't have, but I did. Yeah, already cooked. It's actually correct, Kay. Because your pan's so crowded already. If you put raw chicken in there, it's not gonna cook properly. So, I think Kay accidentally do the right thing. Cooked it and cut it. So, oops. These are jumping out of pan. Sweet corn jumping out of pan. Everything is jumping out of pan. The pea and jumping this? out the pan. Because the pea scared of you. They trying to escape, Kay. Says to add do, 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 do. Two. Turn your phone off, K, before you make YouTube video. 
Oh, I can never open the... Oh, two tablespoons. Two tablespoons of, of what? Soy sauce. Oh, soy sauce correct? I soy sauce correct? Let me pour in it. Come on, it. Is she struggling with soy sauce? Well, that's one. Okay. Come on. Stop being a pain. Come on. She really struggling. This is like the showdown of the century. K fighting with her soy sauce. Forget Logan Paul versus KSI. We now got K versus Kikoman. Soy sauce correct, Nuts. but usually we put at the end after the rice go yeah, in. So Otherwise, your ingredient salty, but your rice too bland. Just cook it, just give it, give it a bit more time. It does say to put a splash of water in. What, what, it does say, what, what you referring to, Kay? She keep referring to something, it say this, it say that. It does say, then it does say, and then it says... What you referring to? Prison food cookbook, is it? Uh, I'm gonna get some water and I'm gonna... Water? I'm no, gonna don't now. put water in your fire rice. Put a splash of water in. What the... No, 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 no. Let's say how much a splash is. <sighs> This a Jamie Oliver move. Remember niece and nephew, Jamie Oliver put water in his egg fried rice and Kay do the same thing. But, but, but Jamie Oliver put water in when the rice in there, rice all gonna get soggy. Kay putting water in before the rice so at least the water have some time to evaporate. Which means Kay actually doing better than Jamie Oliver. Yeah, yeah! So that gives it more time to build up. And did you keep to cook a bit more longer? More longer? <laughs> longer in it. So, uh, yeah. Where this woman it's from? A bit more longer. Time. Then it says now <laughs> to drop the rice in. Rice? Okay, and this rice actually look passable. Big improvement, Kay. Your rice actually edible this time. I know, I know it looked like it come from packet rice, but this is Kay we talking about. The rice looking like this. This big improvement from last two time, not bad. And then it says on the video to add icky. I wouldn't icky. normally do it as a rolling, but Icky, what are you, five-year-old? Exactly as it is. And Icky. Exactly to the video. No, no, egg, egg don't cook like this. You want to cook egg separately and then mix in with the rice. Otherwise, the egg and rice sticking together, it's not good texture. I'm going to mix it all in before it all settles down. I'm throwing it all out to the pan. Not to worry. Stir it round. That is your end product. Hmm. Here is the taste test. And let's do it. Oh, taste. this guy again? Who this guy? Is he her son or her hostage? Okay, where you find this Reddit moderator to taste test your food? Mmm. Is it nice? That is nice. Is it? Can you taste the flavourings? No, but everything else, like all the like um, can you even taste the garlic that you put in? Can you? Can taste yeah, garlic. garlic, good. Um, even the like, it's soy sauce you put in as well. Mm, no, yeah. soy. Soy sauce, not soy. Difference? Yes, there's an A on the end that, that you oh, put an wow. A on the end. Oh god, fucking sue me, I've got dyslexia. <laughs> Last time you eat raw rice and then you eat wet rice, you don't have dyslexia, you have salmonella. Last two times the fried rice so horrible. This one actually very good in comparison. The taste is really, really nice. Thumbs up. Right, as you heard, Lee said it was nice or whatever he said. There's going to be a link in the description to my merchandise. Okay, have much. If you like what you much. see. Okay, she got t-shirt, iPhone case, spot bra. Okay, Uncle Roger gonna buy 1k cooking spot, bruh. What, 32 pound for K cooking spot, bruh? 
What the going rate for sport bra nowadays? 32 pounds seem excessive, but okay, we buy it anyway. Let's go for medium, medium. And check out, okay, this is actually huge improvement. Uncle Roger so proud of you. Niece and nephew, don't give up because everybody can get better at cooking.